Hello friends, I'm Dr. Raman Tanwar. I'm a urologist and an andrologist. And today we'll be talking about penile implant surgery, which is one of the boons in surgery for patients with severe erectile dysfunction. So there are many patients who come to us with erectile dysfunction that is not being managed with either medical management, like drugs, or even with invasive medical management like intracavernosal injections. And such patients, they are really fed up with the medical therapies and they would want something to be done to be able to achieve a healthy sexual life. For such patients, we have a special option which is called the penile implant surgery, which basically consists of implanting two rods into the penis. So these rods, they give rigidity to the penis and enables the patient to perform sexual intercourse and also to satisfy themselves and their partners. Further, we'll be talking about the various types of penile implants which are available. So in my hand, you can see a semi-rigid or a flexible penile implant. Semi-rigid flexible penile implant, it consists of two rods like these, which are placed inside the penis surgically. These rods are normally connected with a button which can be placed into the scrotal sac and can be felt as the third testis. And when this button is pressed, these rods, they will become erect or rigid. When the patient is done with the sexual activity, these rods can be deflated by simply pressing the button again. Once the rods, they are deflated, the penis can easily bend down because these rods, they are semi-rigid or flexible. Such type of penile implants, which are the flexible penile implants, they are available in two forms. One is a two-piece system in which there are rods and a button with a reservoir inbuilt into the button. A second type of penile implant in the flexible variety is the one which is a three-piece implant in which there are two rods, a scrotal button and a reservoir. This kind of a penile implant is a little costlier and requires a more extensive surgery in the form of placement of this reservoir in front of the bladder. But the advantage offered by this penile implant is that it gives a more rigid erection and sometimes it can also be used to increase the length as well as the girth of the penis. These type of implants are a little costlier because they are imported and not usually manufactured in India itself. However, we do have implants which are available or manufactured in India and they are substantially lower in the cost. But the disadvantage of these implants is that they are rigid implants. That means that they cannot be deflated. And once they have been put into the penis, then the penis always will be there in an erect state. And it has to be worn over the abdomen whenever the patient wants that the penis should not be visible to somebody externally. So if we look at the penile implants, there are two main variety of implants that are available. One are the ones which are rigid. The others are the ones which are flexible. The rigid implants will give a permanent erection to the penis and the penis can then not be deflated into the flaccid state. Such implants, they have to be worn over the abdomen. But the advantage of these implants is that the cost is much less. Similarly, we have a flexible penile implant, which can be either two-piece penile implant or a three-piece penile implant. These implants, they can be deflated and the penis can return to a flaccid state or a normal state. At the center of men's health, we are performing penile implants on a regular basis at some of the lowest and most competitive costs in the world. If you're looking for world-class facilities for penile implant surgery, you can check more information at our website and also mail us if you have any queries. We'll be happy to answer you, support you, and also perform the surgery for you to your satisfaction. We look forward to meeting you and getting your feedback. Thank you so much.